We talk a lot about climate change, but it's bigger than that. We're not just changing the climate, we're destabilizing entire ecosystems. We're acidifying the oceans, killing coral reefs, poisoning marine life, and collapsing the food chain from the bottom up. We're causing the greatest mass extinction since the dinosaurs, with species disappearing up to a thousand times faster than the natural rate. We're polluting the planet with plastics, toxins, and chemicals that don't break down, contaminating the soil, oceans, wildlife, and even ourselves. Things the natural world was never built to handle. And while Earth's climate has changed naturally before, it happened over thousands or millions of years, not just a hundred. What we're seeing now isn't part of a slow natural cycle. It's a crash happening at full speed. The greenhouse gases we've pumped into the air are still building, far more than nature alone can absorb, even with all the forests we have left. In some years, like 2023, our forests release more carbon than they captured. And with global warming fueling even more fires and disasters, the collapse is accelerating. This isn't just about the weather changing, it's about survival. Not only ours, but the survival of everything we depend on. Oceans, forests, food, and future generations. And whether we admit it or not, humanity is already dying. Not just through falling birth rates, plummeting sperm counts, or declining cognitive health, but through poisoned soil, broken oceans, and the accelerating collapse of the very systems that keep us alive. Some people think technology will save us. It won't. We can't invent our way out of a dying biosphere or the unraveling of the systems that make life possible. If we don't change course, it won't just be the climate we lose. It'll be the foundation of life itself.